So down in the Fox Cities now, Local 5's Paul Evenson joins us uh, from Nina with a look at their Independence Day preparations. Hi, Paul. Hey, Chris. Yeah, I am here in Riverside Park in my hometown of Nina, getting ready to uh, really uh, kick it for the entire evening here in downtown Nina. Folks have been out here really all day long. You can see as Roz is panning the camera around, they were allowed to come down here starting 5 o'clock yesterday, believe it or not, <laughs> to save their spots with the blankets, with the tarps that you see over there. There have been a, uh, a whole slew of activities going on all day uh, today. It kicked off early this morning, about 8.30, 8.45. With a YMCA Liberty Run and a pancake breakfast, and we've got a lot of fun yet in store for folks, folks who are coming down yet to Riverside Park. FMX Motorcycle Show, Webfooters Water Ski Show is taking place. Of course, there's music. Of course, there's games. There's food booths. Um, there's a little bit of everything for somebody coming down here. And you know, we we even have our own little uh, our, our broadcast uh, our little broadcast speakers. I was going to have uh, Raz. Pan in on that. They, they've got these wired up. They make announcements throughout the park. So, in the case that we do have weather moving in, they make announcements for everybody coming down. But right now, folks have been just down here enjoying the day. It's been great weather. It's been hot. Uh, folks have been diving in the fountain down here to stay cool and finding any way to stay cool. Uh, but so many great things in store. And then, of course, all wraps up at 9 30 with the big festival food fireworks display that's going to be going up right over my shoulder starting about 9 30. So we're looking forward to that. But a lot of fun between here and there. And we'll keep you up abreast of all of it live here from Riverside Park. But for now, I'll toss it back to you, Chris.